Hi everyone, welcome back to Pokemon Unbound. This is part five of six of the Monotype Gauntlet through the Elite Four. Today, we're gonna to be using Poison, Dragon, and Ice types. We didn't have any Poison types throughout the entire playthrough, so I caught seven new ones. We have Toxapex, Scolipede, Alolan Muck, Salazzle, Nidoking, Toxtricity, and Nihilego. You guys already know I'm not using Salazzle. Dragon types. We had Gudra, Haxorus, Zygarde, and technically Ampharos before I went out and added Garchomp, Necrozma, and Curum Black. I think we'll pass on Garchomp here, just to make this team a bit more unique. And the Mono Ice team will contain the amazing Crabominable. We added Rotom Frost, Curum Black, Mamoswine, Weavile, and Alola Ninetales. Thank you so much for all your support on these videos. We're nearly at the end now. Leave a like if you enjoy. Thank you. All right, it's time to take on the Elite Four with Poison types. Uh, I'm gonna be honest, I'm, I'm really nervous, but this should be the last hurdle against Mole, Mole Man. And once we beat Mole Man with this team, I, I think we're fine. <laughs> because, you know, all the other types aren't, aren't weak to ground. I mean, it doesn't mean I'm gonna have an easy time with them necessarily, but it, being weak, you know, to ground ma makes makes the battle a lot harder. So w wish me luck. I do really like the the Poison team I have, but I, I don't, I don't think there's much they can do against Mole Man. Bro, I'm about to just fucking gen in and turn as this, I swear to God. Or e Eternatus, whatever the hell his name is. Um, I'm not really sure what the strat here is. You know, I could run like double scarf mons. It, it's just getting executed out of the way is like the, the big, like Flygon is such a pain in the ass too. I'm not sure what the best line of attack is. Uh, maybe we just, cause no, I feel like Scarf Nido King is gonna be very vital. I, hold on, can Nihilego learn Ice Beam? If Nihilego can learn Ice Beam, then I might be chilling. It can't, okay, never, never mind. <sighs> Avalanche, no, it's not really, okay. All right, let's try this out. I'm gonna protect, and then we're gonna scald. Myrtle should be able to live, barely. Okay, that earthquake did a decent chunk. And then that, okay, we, we live though. We don't burn the Excadrill, unfortunately. And Myrtle does die, okay. Um, I was planning on swapping Myrtle out, but okay. I'm not sure where to go, because all my mons are slow as fuck. I don't know where to go from here. This is hard. Maybe I, Megahorn. I don't know, maybe I Megahorn, Flygon, and I Brick Break the Excadrill. Megahorn and Flygon does. I actually KO it. Okay, that's good info. That's good info. Does Earthquake just straight out? It does so much damage to sick. Brick Break, does this kill? Doesn't quite. Okay. And then the Sandstorm just kills us both. So, like, great. Love that. So, here I want to knock off Quagsire, and I guess I can Ice Beam Excadrill. Quagsire used Yawn. Okay, good. Both of these mons don't get affected by Sandstorm, which is nice. Um, Thankfully, Hat does have a Focus Sash, but it is kind of. Uh, maybe I go into Dandy. I don't know if Dandy has much use here. <sighs> I'm fucked either way. I need to ice beam the sand slash. Oh, we got crit. Let's go. Okay. I don't know if that matters. I definitely mattered. There's no way. And then you yawn. Nido King. Okay. So hopefully, uh, I guess boom burst. And then uh, I have been yawned. I'd like to go to hat though. Boom burst. It does break my sash though, which is kind of annoying. Uh, I think I'm fucked. He's going to yawn again. Okay. We can work with this. We can work with this. I can boom burst again. And I can, I guess I can knock off. Do I, do I knock off? I, I guess I knock off by score. Get rid of. Uh, bright powder. Oh, it's holding bright powder. And I still missed. Holy shit. All right, Boom Burst has a decent chunk. Oh, I scored on double team. Fox is sleeping now, unfortunately. I'll just keep Boom Bursting if I can. Okay. And then I think I want to. If I just Sludge Bomb Quagsire, will that, will that kill it? Doesn't quite kill. He did poison though. Let's go. Fly scores double teaming. Muddy Water is going to drop accuracy, which is just fucking great. Fag's dead. Now it's just these two dickheads. Okay. Boom Burst and Sludge Bomb. They're both sleeping, so I'll let them go down. All right. This is where it gets hard. So I Ice Beam Landorus. Earthquake, don't kill. Oh. <gasps> Okay, I need, I need this ice beam more than anything. And we miss. <sighs> Holy shit, dude. We got so close there. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. That crit I got, I got against Sandslash was, was essential. Cause like, now I can't even kill Sandslash. And like, like I, like Sandslash needs to be done in one hit. Like I, um, maybe I scarf Toxtricity instead of throat spraying it. I can't think of anything else. Okay. All right, let's try this. Let's try. Okay, protect. Oh, I actually draw light speeds. Toxtricity though. Oh my God. Okay. I need this to be known. I'm like never getting the fucking burns. All right, let's try this. And then Landorus comes in instead. Okay. 
so this is a different scenario. So let's half the ice beam. And I, I guess I have to boom burst. Boom burst does so much damage to me though. Holy shit. Ice beam, sand slash, and then boom burst. Okay, and that does handle it. Okay, good. U turns the toxicity. Okay, good. All right, so then I ice beam glide score, and then I just can. This is so risky. Okay, I, I ice beam Landorus, and I continue to boom burst. Ah, <sighs> no, that's not that's not the wave. That's not the wave. No, I just die and lose. Ugh. Is there anything Nihiligal can do? Because this thing is literally just useless right now. Why does this thing not learn ice beam, dude? The only thing I can think of is grass not but i don't think that's gonna uh i don't i don't know i guess i can try it okay so it kind of works please let me burn please let me uh finally i burn i don't even know if it helps that much but all right mega horn this idiot please just land of course as soon as i get the burn i'd start missing mega horns i want to die dude all right this is good so i've got a special attack buff on the Halego. nice plus ice beam please don't earthquake please don't earthquake please just u-turn thank you this thing is obsessed with u-turning just fucking u-turns back into himself that's so funny all right we're gonna grass not this we miss ice beam kill landorus fly score needs to fuck off all right it's just these two i just need this fly score to fuck off Truthfully, it's just I just keep missing Ice Beam and he's not even set up double teams or anything. It's I'm there. I, I literally have the battle down. I just need to stop missing Ice Beam on the Glide score and I need to use like three of them to kill it or some fucking. It's so frustrating that it comes down to a roll. It's I, I can't express how fucking annoying it is. I genuinely can't. And I actually think that this works worse for me. Mega Horn kill, then Brick Break kills this. And now these guys are still alive for some reason. And because these guys are still alive, things just don't work out. So I'm going to try and poison the Glide score with poison. And I guess I'll just knock off. We don't get a poison jab poison, so that's fine. I don't, uh, I don't think this works out for me. Um, I can Ice Beam you and I can Grass not you. Uh, yeah, it just doesn't work out. It just doesn't work out. It just doesn't work out. Um, ice Beam kill the fly score very good yeah no i don't yeah i don't have anything uh wait hold on okay no okay i need like nihilego scarf grass not is a good idea that is a very good idea i just need the battle to go a very specific way so watch this so yep yep wait no he crit me so i have to reset yep okay but okay so listen this is how it goes i hit the protect i scald don't get the burn that's fine that works better then we go into sick and then i have to land mega horn and brick break we land Plus brick break, cool, cool. They die. I go into Henry and I go into Hat. Um, okay, this kind of works. I then ice beam you and I grass not you. This thing needs to stop yawning seriously. Okay, I guess I then switch into Dandy and then I grass not you to finish you. That doesn't finish you. Okay. Ah, uh, this is not the battle that I signed up for. And he's gonna. Okay. He's just gonna. Yeah, the grass not. It just, yeah, it doesn't work. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. All right, I took a five minute break to do some laundry. Hopefully that's uh all the power I need to uh. And I miss Mega Horn. <sighs> it's just everything has to go my way in this battle. Otherwise, like there's no room for mistakes. And battles like these are the most annoying because like I know how to win. It's just if it doesn't go perfectly, then I don't. So we have to land Mega Horn. Yep. Brick break. Yep. Done. Cool. Cool. These guys go down. Henry can come in. Hat can come in. He sends a glass score. It's a bit. I'll ice beam it. And then I grass not the Excadrill. Excadrill lives. <laughs> and so. <laughs> okay. All right, we grass not and uh, no, this is frustrating. I don't. We die either way, right? <laughs> Fuck. Oh, I you know sand slash protect. That's right. That's right. Sand slash protect. Okay, that's. I was like wondering, like, how do I get past that? Okay, sand slash protect. Okay, okay, I can do this. Just suddenly started missing fucking mega horn a bunch now. I never want to battle the elite four again after this. One of you guys suggested that I do uh, an insane run of the elite four as like a as like a final send off to the series, and I'm I got a crit. I'm tempted. I want to, you know, use my favorite Pokemon and do an insane run. But like, if I can't get past Mole Man, bro, I'm just not gonna upload it. Like, if you if I don't upload a, a Pokemon Unbound insane difficulty Elite Four run, it's like a like a nice send off to the series. It's just because I couldn't get past Mole Man. Okay, <laughs> it's just because I couldn't get past Mole Man. Okay, um, yeah, I don't really. I guess I just try to poison jab. Yeah, I, I when I put yeah, it's just, this isn't this isn't the run. This isn't the run. Because, oh wait, hold on, hold on, okay, hold on, maybe it is, maybe it is, maybe it is, maybe, maybe this is the run, boom burst, nope, never mind, never mind, I'm running throat spray again on my toxicity, so never mind, burning the Excadrill is actually a bad thing, because it dies, and I don't want it to die, <laughs> maybe I knock off, maybe that's better, uh, not really, it still dies, yeah, and then these dickheads come in, can I poison, can I poison Gliscor, I can, ooh, maybe this is better for me, Lander's gonna use her now, so I'm gonna, Grass Knot plus Ice Beam. Oh my god, okay, hold on. All right, Ice Beam plus Grass Knot onto the... Okay, hold on. 
Oh my god, I found the run. I found the run. Oh my god, I found the run. Maybe I didn't. I don't know. Oh my god, please, please. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. I found the run. Holy shit. Oh my god, I don't care. I'm so happy, dude. Holy fuck. It took me like half an hour just to beat him, which I mean, obviously, I've had worse. I've had two hour runs. You know, with uh, fire types. So, you know, opposing type superior, I guess. But, like, fuck me, man. All right. Uh, Mimikyu is the lead here for this battle. So, how do I... How do I beat a Mimikyu? A nice Myrtle can maybe handle it. I don't know, truthfully. Let's just give it a shot. I'll just set up spikes. I don't actually know if spikes work on the... Uh, the whatever the fuck's going on with this this battlefield. Yeah, okay. We, we just stall that Mimikyu with it. Okay, cool. We're fine. Yeah, spikes don't actually even work. That's so cringe. Okay. So, now Trevenant is here for a reason. It's probably going to leech seed me. Oh, I wish I had liquid ooze on this guy. I'll go into him. Yep, there's a leech. Seed. I'll head over to knock off. Oh, okay. And yeah, we're burned. We're just, we're just, we're just, we're just gonna die. Okay. I'll just gunk shot. Cool. Go for Grigus comes in. I'm gonna knock off. Get rid of his item. Uh, he sets up the defenses. Okay. Myrtle can handle this. Get, get, I just need you to burn Myrtle. That's all. Just I need you to get a cheeky burn. Yes. Let's go. All right. Now we recover up and watch it die. <laughs> <laughs> I can haze to get rid of its defense buffs. I can recover again. We can scald this. Does Myrtle just sweep? <laughs> Myrtle might just sweep. Uh, I, at least I know setting up toxic spikes is pointless too. All right, cool. We recover. Oh wait, it's not pointless because after his shadow shield's broken. Okay, that's not so bad. That's not so bad. Okay, I'm gonna set up a leech seed again. Um, not a problem for Myrtle really, if I'm being honest. But I'll go into boost, leech seed, protect, get a speed buff. Um, hmm, Age of Slash is annoying. Toxtricity handles Age of Slash though. We got uh, Overdrive which uh, goes through sub and we overdrive again to go through sub cool we'll just let him die speed buff that's fine maybe i think uh, i'm going to power jam you and i'm going to power jam you and you're dead cool and then i'm scarf right yeah i'm scarf i guess i just got a power jam oh that did oh yeah we got special attack buffs is nihilego let's fucking go let's fucking go nihilego can you guys imagine if i uploaded these individually <laughs> oh my god dude all right, I want no excuses from these poison types. Put your back into it, bro. Um, we do have Mok to deal with. Um, Rubombi's shield, uh, the fucking light screens and such. So hopefully, oh yeah, I, uh, I can't status inflict, can I? Okay, let's try this. Let's try poison jabbing, and then we're gonna poison jab again, and then I'm gonna protect. Okay, I, I guess I just poison jab again. Oh my god, flamethrower just okoed me? Holy shit, okay. I shouldn't protect against Togekiss because it, it likes to use Wish. So I, I, I've learned my lesson there. All right, I think um, School of Heat's valuable here. But just double, yeah, we just poison jab, poison jab, poison jab again. It just doesn't quite get the KO. We need to poison it, which is like a 20, 30% chance, I think. So that's not too bad. We'll just, um, okay, reflect being up isn't a problem. Okay, we're fine. Triple poison jab for the kill. Um, I'm gonna buff top with home pass. And we're going to sick. Now we're fast as fuck. We're a really fast muck, um, which is kind of fucking cool, actually. Uh, except for when Mawile comes in. I didn't think about that one. Um, okay. Mawile can get fucked by an earth power, though. Doesn't quite kill. All right, Dandy's Overdrive's got this. Let's go. I'll sludge bomb you. Let's let's go. Sludge bomb, sludge bomb. Yeah, we're, we're fine. I'm not scared of this battle at all. I'll protect. And then I'll use poison jab. Cool. And then we just poison jab this thing and we're good. All right, easy. Like that that battle had a lot of leeway. There was very few ways for me to lose that battle because like obviously we we're just a whole team of poison types. Like I'm literally built to counter you. So that wasn't so bad. Now we have to take on Dwagon. Um, Gudra and Tyrantrum lead. I think Needle King just ice beaming the Tyrantrum would be good. Garfney Halego, maybe I need to get rid of Grass Knot. I'm not sure. We'll try ice beaming. We'll see if that knocks it out. I will... Okay, yeah, we'll Grass Knot. Okay, Grass Knot does a lot. Cool. I don't... I, I, I need to check if Ice Beam just straight up KO. I don't think Ice Beam's gonna straight up KO, though. I don't think it will. But I need to check anyway. So I will power down the Gudra. Ice Beam does straight up KO. Okay. All right, Henry. I underestimated you. Okay. Okay. All right. We'll power gem you and Ice Beam you. Okay. All right. So I think we need to get Sludge Bomb back on Nihilego. So we just Ice Beam this Tarantrum and then I'll just Sludge Bomb Gudra. Get the poison. Nice. Big damage. Then we'll Ice Beam and we'll Sludge Bomb this Komoto. We miss. Of course we do. All right, dog. I'm going to gunk shot the Komoto. Cool. Dead. All right. And then I'm um, plus one now. So Mega Horn Ladia should die. Plus, I'll just knock off Gudra. Adias dies, cool. Gudra dies. I've been sleeping on a... Mm, do I? Yeah, I guess I'm Megahorn Sceptile. And I... Uh, no more gunk shots. I'll just break break the Hydreigon. I've been sleeping on... Uh, of course I miss. 
Awesome, dude. At least the brick break got a fucking poison touch. Uh, and I'm pretty sure he has beats me now, so... Oh, wait, never mind, we're good. I was gonna say, I'm sleeping on school of beats. School of beats kind of tight. Brick break dead. And I think that's it. Cool, yeah, we won. Nice. Now, hopefully the last battle goes over well. Because if so, then my poison team did relatively well. As soon as we got past um, the ground type dickhead, like, poison types didn't struggle at all. Like, they have not struggled one bit. It just depends what the final hurdle is here. <laughs> fucking milo so yeah poison types signed up fucking awesome they they did such a good job dude i'm so happy all right sludge bomb he gets the light screen up but that's okay it's actually probably not but uh whatever i'm lying i'm just gonna lie to you guys uh i think oh yeah he's not gonna rising voltage henry exactly so i will swap out and go into sick and then we're gonna swap out you and go into myrtle okay he's psy shocking instead interesting all right i will knock off and i will recover rising voltage that's fine close combat that's fine knock off kill we did a lot of damage i'm gonna go into boost i'm gonna knock off the glade I'm gonna protect on boost. All right, let's see if hat can have speed. I'm gonna try and knock off the Raichu. Actually, no, I'll try and sludge on the Raichu. Yeah, no, I still have speed, no matter what. Okay, cool. Well, at least he's dead now. Henry and Dandy left. Ooh, this is kind of a scary, scary sight. So I just sludge wave and overdrive. Sludge wave, overdrive. Cool, he's dead. All right, we're, we should be okay. Sludge wave, overdrive. Ooh, maybe not. Sludge wave. No, okay, we didn't. We, we actually lost to Milo. Holy shit. We should be okay, though. We just need to tinker things um power gem you sludge wave maybe yeah maybe sludge waving's better sludge wave Ugh, this raichu's a pain in the ass dude Sly shock needle king you dick you absolute dick i'll knock off the raichu and power gem the raichu raichu needs to go cool bye bye mr man can just sit there and be a cunt all he wants i don't have any gunk shots no i'll, I'll kill mr man fuck it dude i'm gonna set up a toxic spikes yeah toxic spikes are set up knock off on glade again and i'm gonna scald glade oh never mind fucking Fable wants to be a dick. Um, it's got the follow me's out. Okay, there's not much I can do to it while it's using follow me. Besides, just keep attacking. To be honest, I'll haze in case there's any like stat buffs going on. Cool, because I've not been paying attention, and I'm going to poison jab the Clefable and keep scalding. Yep, get the fuck out of my way. Cool. All right, poison. We're gonna protect now, and I'm gonna scald you. I will. Poison jab you and recover up. Cool. Dead. Mr. Mime sets up the screens again, whatever. And then we just got Odino. All right, we're fine. We've got this in the bag. Set up your stats all you want, Odino. You're fucked, kid. You're absolutely fucked. You've got two goats against you. All right, done. What a team. What a team. Squad goals. Squad goals. We stand. All right, it's the type you've all been waiting for. Dragon. These nuts. Uh, so dragon types are just really good. They're just, they're just better than the average Pokemon, unless your name's like Kurtinator and Drudigan. But yeah, like these are, these are pretty solid type. Um, I think I'm pretty happy with the team comp. Pretty unique. Um, you know, no, no Dragonites, no, no, uh, Garchomps. I'm trying to think of other, of other dragons. But yeah, we got like Mega Ampharos. We got fucking Necrozma on the team. Like it's, it's a pretty unique dragon team. I hope we have a relatively easy time. Let's uh, let's let's give it a shot. Now, as for who we lead with, I'm not sure. Maybe we lead Swaco, and mm, it's quite hard. Would Kieran Blackout speed Flygon? I don't remember. I feel like Flygon's faster. Damn, all my dragons are actually relatively slow. Maybe I should have a Dragonite so I can spam Earthquake next to it. Damn it, dude. Um. Okay. Yeah. I'm. I'm a little. Uh, I'm a little lost as to what I should lead with, but we'll just give this a shot. We're gonna get clanging scales to all hell and back. So. Uh, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna hit a, I'm gonna hit a dragon pulse. Oh, I'm gonna hit a dragon dance. We'll see how this goes. Earthquake. How much does that do? Ouch. And then the clanging scales. Okay, we still live though. We, we still love and oh yeah Swaco gets the activation so that's not so bad um I'm trying to think we're plus one. Oh my god that sprite he looks like such a manlet. <laughs> Holy shit. Alright Tyler one fucking hell. Maybe I, I don't know what I do to be honest. Earthquake. He's, yeah, he still outspeeds me. That's not good. Okay, not good leads. My entire team is weak to... Hmm. I'm gonna Scarf Cure on Black for now. Let me save my game. So hit him with a Scarf Icicle Spear, and then we Dragon Dance up. Cool, Flygon's fucked. Dragon Dance up. Very cool, but Icicle Spear you. And I suppose, I mean, maybe I can just start off an Outrage. Okay, Protect, Icicle Sphere, Outrage, nice, good, good, good. All right, Intimidates us, I can Icicle Sphere the fucking Landorus. Landorus is dead too, nice. And just like that, the fucking presence of many is here and uh, 
Yeah, I think we're I think we're good. I think we got this battle in the bag. We'll set up a swords dance and I <sighs> I want an earthquake so bad. You know what? Maybe I should swap into motel and just fire off an earthquake. Yeah. Sack the motel. Not even sacking it to be honest. We'll dragon claw glide score and I'm just gonna outrage again. Big damage. Yeah, okay. I need I, I need this this glide score is gonna be a, a, a piece of piece of work. But um if we can I think someone said that um Z moves are guaranteed lands. So I set up a swords dance and then we light that burns the sky. I don't know how true that is. Is, are Z moves guaranteed to hit? I guess they are. I was not aware. Does that kill? It does. Fuck Glide Score. All right, let's just power with this stupid fucking Quags there and get this over with. All right, awesome. Oh, I've never felt so good about beating him. I'm just so glad that that did not take forever. I really hope the Fairy Type 1 doesn't give me too much trouble. All it took was to Choice Scarf a Cure and Black. All right, Mimic you. Um, maybe like Banded Icicle Spear. All right, Banded Icicle Spear. And he switches up. What a pussy. Pussy. I'm gonna set up a dragon dance. Substitute all you want. You fucking, uh, you toxic and prick. You toxic and prick. And I, all my dragon dances are being, all my, my earthquakes rather are being wasted. <coughs> earthquake, uh, earthquake, dead, cool. Oh, actually, no, wait, literally, I have motel. The motel was literally built to kill Mimikyu's. I forgot about that. Okay, let's see. I'm banded, so I guess I have to just outrage. Banded outrage. Flame Thor kills, that's fine. I, like dragons are just so good. I don't really have to think. I can kind of just send in Pokemon and send Pokemon in super effective attack win. We'll Swords Dance up and I'm gonna fucking, um, I'm, I'm, I'm okay. I, I, I kind of fumbled the bag a bit there. Pwn Claws and then there's Dragon da dragon Claw. How did that not kill dude? Is Trevenant really that fat? Dude, Blacevalon's a pain in the ass. Blacevalon needs to go. Go away. And then Bennett. This is like one of the most unclean battles <clears throat> I've ever I've ever participated in. But uh, I think we win as long as Ambrose lands. And Ambrose didn't. Oh no, Ambrose did. Okay, Ambrose just slower the Bennett for some reason. Cool, easy clap, done. Also, nobody's been complaining about it, but I'm sorry if I'm like speeding up a bit too much. Because usually what I do is like when I'm talking, I'll stop speeding up. But because of the nature of these battles and how frequently I have to reset. I, I just get fed up and I'm just like, okay, I just need to speed up and talk also. So like people can see the thought process and like, yeah, it helps me get them done faster. All right, we've got Rabombi here. It's going to speed us no matter what. It's going to set a reflect no matter what. Okay. Banded Icicle Spheres kind of, kind of popping off. Uh, not really, not really the best idea. We need to run a Scarf user. Maybe, and maybe Scarf Curumbi. Also, I, I've, I've been, I've been forgetting to change it. I spell his name wrong. It's, it's, he's named after an artist I like, and I spell it wrong. That's my bad, guys. This is how it's spelled. <laughs> two Ks, not two Cs. All right, Icicle Sphere. Yeah, it's not quite enough. I'm gonna try Life Orb instead. Set up a Dragon Dance and a uh, Fusion Ball. Yeah, Fusion Ball. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> not ideal, but fucking Icicle Sphere doesn't even it doesn't even kill. It doesn't even kill. Reflect is so annoying, dude. All right, another idea. Scarf Haxorus. Just miss an Iron Tail. Awesome. Doesn't even matter. He's just Moonblast. <sighs> Yeah, it doesn't even matter. All right, I've got an idea. I don't know how this is going to work, but we'll, um, we'll Iron Tail this, let myself die, immediately go into Soft War. We then Earthquake, and then we can Light That Burns the Sky, the Sylveon. It doesn't quite kill. <sighs> it doesn't kill. That's so dumb. I fucking hate, hate everything, dude. All right, I've got Ben and Jerry's ice cream, so hopefully that will uh, hopefully that'll power up the brain, you know? Cookies and cream for anyone wondering. Well, cookie dough rather, not cookies and cream, sorry. I lied. All right, let's try this. Dragon dance, dragon dance, dragon dance. Okay, dragon dance again. Moon blasts me, that's fine. Now my icicle sphere. Okay, nice. Good shit. <clears throat> oh, Icicle Sphere? Nice, okay. Icicle Sphere? Nice. Three Mons dead. There is webs up, but that's okay. I think I Swords Dance here, and then I Light That Burns the Sky, this idiot. Pop, dead. Zoom Roll comes in. Bone Geyser, Bone Geyser, dead. And then Mawile. <clears throat> Earthquake, after we get Sucker Punched. Okay, all right, we should be fine. Earthquake. Yep. Uh, earthquake. Nope, never mind. Um, <laughs> earthquake. All right, cool. We got it. Nice. <laughs> Holy shit. That wasn't so bad. I just, I was sitting there thinking, I'm like, dude, how do I get past Rabombi? And then I was like, okay, it likes to set up both screens and then it'll Moonblast me. So then I thought, okay, I'll get three Dragon Dances up because I know I would take a Moonblast. But it turns out it has Sticky Webs too. So I'm like, ah, even better. I got another Dragon Dance up. And yeah, I knew I, would, I wouldn't I would be able to live much because of the Life Orb, but I think the Life Orb was essential for getting like some KOs. So yeah. That was nice. It was a nice plot by me. Now it's time for dragon versus dragon. Only Gudra and Komoto. No, wait, no, not Komoto. I'm going to try. <clears throat> no, maybe I just outrage. Maybe it was double outrage. 
Uh huh. Bye bye, Gudra. I rage into Tarantrum, dead. I rage into Komoto, dead. Holy shit. I did not expect that from Swaco. Mega evolved and rock slid, and did we both flinch? We both flinched. Awesome. Thanks for saving us confusion. I'm gonna Icicle Spear you and Dragon Dance if I can. Never mind. I just got the Dragon Dance off. All right. I will. I'll just fucking outrage, dude. And uh, I'll outrage as well. This is an outrageous battle. Hey, Spaco got the outrage off. On the right Mon too. Let's go. I think we should be okay. We'll just drag him down. Dragon Claw. That's fine. Take him out. spaco has got this. Let's go. Plus, we're sensing the presence of many. Power Construct. Give me my HP back. And we got Gudra versus Gudra. Spaco's fully paralyzed, but that's okay. He's he's, he's avoiding. He's do he's dodging and weaving those confusion from the rage. So um, that's all I can have that. Dude, Gudra... Not good, right? Um, fucking <clears throat> Zygarde is such a fat bitch, dude. This thing's just been sitting here this whole battle. He's literally just been eating these muddy wars, and then he just breaks through an outrage. That's my fucking Zygarde is goaded. Let's go. A lot of these battles, I've just not even had to think about. I've just, I just kind of was like, oh, uh, I press button and win. I don't think the dragon team is one of the best teams, but it, you know, the Pokemon, all the Pokemon are just really good. Like, we still haven't seen um the evil villain guy. I forget his name. No, not him. The boss. I forget his name. Zeph. Still haven't seen him. Whatever. I know you have. Power up punch, but you're not going to use it for some reason. Okay. I will icicle spear you, which does nothing. Okay, I'm just going to reset. I don't even probably, don't, probably don't even need to reset. Uh, I'm going to set up dragon dances. Oh, he has. Okay, he has. He has ice punch that hurt. I will outrage. Crocodile comes in and tries to stop me, but nothing can stop me because I'm a fucking Zygarde and I'm going to keep outraging. No. Dragon Pulse dead. Like, I, like I'm saying, like, dragons don't even need to think, dude. Like, they don't even need to think. This thing got drop speed because of Gooey, so I'm going to send in this and outspeed it now. Kill. And then I'm going to fucking kill you too. And then I'm gonna kill. I'm gonna kill this with a light that burns this guy. Yep, that was. I didn't even have to think, dude. And that is how you beat Pokemon Unbound with a Mono Dragon team. The last team for today is Ice. I'm actually kind of scared because Ice types are are hit or miss. It's a pretty fucking cool team. I like it. All right, it's time for the Ice types. Uh, this is the team we're walking out with. Um, nothing, nothing new, really. You know, these are all Pokemon we've seen throughout the Mono type run. They're just all coming together now to form the Ice team. Um, yeah. We'll see how it goes. Uh, I've given them some items, but you know, the items are always subject to change. You know, maybe I just run Scarf Ninetales again. Scarf Ninetales plus Scarf Rotom. Just spam Blizzard. Sucks, because I, uh, yeah, we, we, we just see it doesn't quite kill, but does it need to kill? I don't know. I really just missed fucking Blizzard on, like, four Blizzards. Holy shit. I'm tired of this Quagsire constantly spamming Yawn, but it's okay, because it just means he just keeps having, he keeps having things to Yawn. So he kind of just stays useless. All right, you U-turning. Going to Glyscore. Boris misses. God, I love it. All right, I need you to I need, I need, I need, I need someone to land. If Boros could just land, there it is. Dead. All right, Boros can go. Um, I'll switch into black here. Yup. All right, let's, uh, let's ice punch the fucking Landorus and also ice shard the Landorus. Nice. There's that yawn again. Knock off. And I guess I'll just ice go crash. Cool. Done. All right. Didn't really have to think that one through. Similar to like how the dragon types work. Like if I'm just super effective against you, I'm probably going to have a relatively easy time, which I'm not the biggest fan of battles like that, but I also... I'm not going to fight. I'm not going to fight it. I've been having such a, this has been such a big, like this is taking me up so much more time than I thought I, I would. I, I thought I would have been done by now. Uh, so, you know what? I'll take like any easy win I can get, even if it's a win that I didn't feel like I earned. All right, Mimikyu. Um, Blizzard it. Okay, so I guess the hail does affect it. All right, whatever. All right, you know what? I'm going to choice specs my Rotom and then I'm gonna give them to the Mimikyu. So it's Swords Dance then oh okay it's that's not how it works I guess because it's faster than me. Okay that's kind of annoying. I guess we can do Scarf then. I didn't really want to Scarf Mimikyu running rampant on me but it's all good. I will trick it. Now it's Swords Dance so now it's stuck into Swords Dance. Cool. All right that's a good way to handle it and then we've got Bicephalon now which fire type move. Uh, everything's weak to uh, except oh, oh yep and I get burned. Awesome. <laughs> Woo! Yay! Okay. I am running Sash Weavile though, so I can live a hit and then knock off. Yeah, okay. This thing wants to. Dude, uh, I hate this body pressing idiot. Maybe I just went to Boros and uh, Ice Hammer did so much damage, but it's not quite enough to take it out. It's all good though. Thunderbolt. Dude, these guys are hard. Holy shit. All right, let me go to Wagyu. And we'll just we'll do a little earthquaking. We 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 we, we press earthquake a few times. We 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 uh we we do a little we do a little EQing. Please just let me kill you. I'm so tired of Age Slash. This is a scarf mon. Yep, scarf sneak, that's fine. Let's out the hail. And I'm going to gleam 
Okay. Do I have speed you? I do. I froze you. Okay. I, I, I wasn't strong enough to kill you, but cool. All right. I'm going to gleam. Ah, scarf play rough now. Yeah. See, that's what I feared. <laughs> I'm going to knock off. Yeah. There we go. Cool. This thing is sucker punch. That doesn't even matter. Yeah. Thunderbolt dead. Cool. I can you know, I'm going to volt switch and th then I'm going to blizzard. Oh, I missed. I thought the hail was still up. No. Oh my God. This is so awful. I do think tricking the mimic is a nice way to disarm it. Then I'll volt switch. Cool. The Cephalon comes in and then we go into Weavile and we threaten knockoff. He's going to want to go into Kogrigus, so we go to Boris. And I Ice Hammer you and then I Ice Hammer you again. How, how did he? Oh, Ice Hammer. That drops my speed. <sighs> Boys, I am losing my patience. I just want to, I just want to be done with this challenge. Cool. This is a very calculated battle, apparently. Trick. Volt switch, dagger, and then we scare you out. We're going to Boris, and Boris is going to break the shadow shield, and then we're going to ice hammer. <laughs> no, I'm banded. Oh my god, dude, get a grip. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, I fuck me, I suppose. I then go into Nine Tails and Blizzard, and Age Slash comes in. I'm going to wag you. I'm just going to spam some earthquakes. Cool, nice. Uh, I'm scarfed. Okay. I'm going to Pachinko and hit him with a Blizzard. Doesn't quite kill, which is frustrating. I definitely need more PP on my Blizzard. It's fine. We're going to dra Dagger, and I'm going to knock off. Nice. Knocked off the Scarf on the Mimikyu. Going to Pachinko, because it's kind of on its last legs. Set up the Hail again, and Blizzard this fucking... It doesn't kill. Oh my god. All right. Just just Gleam. Just die. Thank you. The Cephalons. <sighs> so there's this clown. I think I just lose again. Outrage. Outrage. Knock off. Nice. Can I finish this? Knock off. Doesn't quite kill. No, I was so close. This Trevenant is so fat, dude. The Cephalon will die. Bye bye. Mimic you. Oh god, okay. Okay, Mimic you. At least it's scarfed into Shadow Sneak now. I will set up Dragon Dances and I will Icicle Spirit because I have Mold Breaker, essentially. Cool. That actually worked out very well for me. I'm going to outrage now. Thank you. Thank you. I won. That was a bit of a stressful battle, but we got there in the end. I quite like this team. Now we need to do... <clears throat> uh, let me think. Who do I... Hmm. I place my sash user against your sash user and probably lose. Damn it, dude. I fucking hate reflect. Oh, well, I accidentally won. Cool. I'll, I'll, I'll leave that. <laughs> I'll leave that battle on screen. Hopefully I remember to do that. <laughs> that was a that was a toughie. I mean, it wasn't too bad, obviously, because it didn't take me long, but I didn't really think about it too hard. I just made sure Mawel died to Mamoswine and uh, the rest kind of went from there. All right, we've got to fight dragons. So that's uh, that's easy. We got this double blizzards. All right, blizzard and blizzard. And I think we can just win the battle like this. Uh, blizzard and blizzard. Easy clap. And then we just blizzard and blizzard. Yeah, yeah, relatively easy battle. Cool. You know what's actually crazy? This might actually be my shortest Elite Four run yet. In terms of, like, this is literally taking me 21 minutes. Like, this is faster than ground and electric, which is kind of insane. I mean, maybe I'm just speeding up more here. But, like, I don't know. Like, that's just madness. I mean, obviously, I'm probably not winning right now. Eh, maybe I'm okay. It's hard to tell. Icicle Crash, Dragon Dance up, Close Combat's me, ouch, ouch, that was rude, you're a rude dude, uh, yep, Icicle Crash, uh, yeah, okay, I probably need to, yeah, I need to think this one through a bit more, I also need to start putting out a fucking Blizzard PP, alright, we just both Blizzard, I suppose, yay, we froze the Raichu, let me swap out Pachinko instead of just letting him die a miserable death, <laughs> 
Cool. Um, I will Icicle Crash and knock off. I probably I attacked the wrong mod because I'm a bit silly. Um, I'll Icicle Crash you and I'm gonna Thunderbolt you. Yeah, we got this one. Icicle Crash, Thunderbolt, doesn't matter because Clefable is gonna use Follow Me, so it doesn't matter. I'm going to Icicle CR. I mean, no, Fusion Bolt because it's in the Electric Train and Thunderbolt. Fusion Bolt, nice, big damage. This is a close one. This is definitely a close one. Fusion Bolt, cool, it's dead. Ice Hammer, nice. All right, we got this. Nice. And that, ladies and gentlemen. Nope, wait, hold on. <laughs> Uh, uh, Icicle Sphere, please come. I didn't win. Almost. Almost. All right, let's get rid of this Glade. Thank you. Get rid of Clefable because it's a big fat bitch. Oh, I just realized we're not actually benefiting from electric terrain because we're levitating. Yeah, I'm a bit silly. Sorry about that. All right, whatever. We got this. Actually, this time. Oh, wait, that did nothing. Holy shit. Hopefully, we actually have this this time. I'm going to Dragon Dance up. Okay. Dragon Dance up. Now we're going to Fusion Bolt. Thunderbolt. Fusion Bolt did a big damage. Dude, this thing is so annoying. Holy shit. All right, Boris, I need you to big damage. Big damage, please. Doesn't matter. Pachinko got it. And that is definitely the fastest run so far, I'm pretty sure, which is insane. I am pleasantly surprised by uh, Poison Dragon and Ice types. They all they all surprised me today. So shout out to those types. This has been part five of the monotype run. All there is left to do is fighting, flying, and bug. Some uh, relatively interesting types too. The monotype run. So look at these dudes. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, leave a like. And next time is the final Unbound monotype run video. And after that, I'm probably going to do like one or two more videos of Unbound just to wrap the series up completely. You know, there's a few little side quests we need to do. But this was like the big, this is such a big part of the game. This is taking up way too much of my time. This is taking up more time than the actual fucking playthrough. I swear to God. I hope this is worth it. I hope you guys appreciate this. If you do, just leave a like. Thank you. All right. Fuck you, mole man. Mole man.